solve for x. Okay, uh, can somebody uh, tell me what is the first step here? We have some of uh, the students online. Anybody with a microphone? Okay, Karen, just type in to multiply. Go ahead. Okay, who wanted to go uh, next? I, I can go. This is Shannon. Um, you distribute the, the x. Okay, you get x squared minus 4x equal to minus 4. Okay, go on, Shannon. What's the next step? Um, so, um, add 4 to both sides. Okay. And, yeah. All right. What do we do next? Next, you um you factor. It's going to be x in parentheses x plus two times x plus two. That's good. And then what's the answer? X equals two. You mean negative two, right? Yes, negative two. Okay, very good. All right, so the both uh, solutions to the second order equation uh, would be equal to x equal to negative two. Well, let's take a look at this. If this is if this is true, uh, that's what uh, what Shannon uh, gave us here. So we have x squared minus four x plus four. Uh, so in this case, uh, would would that work though? But look, take a look. Uh, if I multiply these two together, two times two, well, that gives me uh, plus four, right? But look, if I multiply the two closest term and two furthest term together, this is two x, and this is another two x. Well, remember we need minus minus 4x. So, uh, Shannon, would you uh, mind uh, correcting this? What do you think we should do? Yeah, it should be, I apologize, it should be x minus 2 times x minus 2. Right, absolutely. Right. Yeah, that's how to be minus. So, this then uh, would be, the final answer would be uh, plus 2 then, right? Yes. Okay, very good. The final answer would be plus two. That now this is correct. Uh, so the, the two solutions for this would be identical. Would be uh, positive two. Very good. Okay, those of you are uh, online. Any question? Anyone? Or you are okay with this? Okay. Looks like everybody okay. Let's move on. <coughs> 